it's me again. We, I have here Suga and Ken. Yes, they are from Japan. And for today, guys, we are going to the different historical places and beautiful places here within Mustang and Cebu City. So first up, we'll be going to Mustang Drive. So we are currently here in Mustang, Utah, where Suga and Ken are staying at Savoy Hotel. And um, um, actually, Mactan Shrine is just nearby because Mactan Shrine is like um, there was this um, chief king of this island. Uh, he, is, he is called Lapu Lapu. That is why this city is called Lapu Lapu. Yeah. Uh, yes. And um, when the Spaniards came, like 1521, um, they went first to the city. But however, the chief king of Lapu Lapu, the Mactan Island, doesn't like the Spaniards. Because they have the the, the Spaniards want to conquer this island, but the Lapu Lapu, the chief chain of this island, that has won it, and so they fought nearby. Ah, and this is this is that is also where uh, the the leader of the Spaniards, the uh, Ferdinand Magellan, was killed. Uh, that is why there's a shrine of Lapu Lapu, the chief chain, who killed him and victorious and. And that is why there was there was like 40 years wherein the Spaniards didn't came came to conquer. So it's like first time they see they they step in Cebu City and then they came to Lapu Lapu because of that battle of Mactan. Um, they never came back. But only after 40 years, um, when Lapu Lapu maybe he was already old or dead, he came, that they came back. Okay, so we will go there now, guys. So, Mustang Shrine. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Let's go. So we have finally visited the Mactan Shrine or Lapu Lapu Shrine. So what can what do you think about it? Wow, it's very historical. Yes, yes. Impressive. And we are here in the 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 um, Magellan Cross. It is where the the cross of Magellan was planted, and until now, it is still here, existing here in the island of Cebu. And I'm still with Suga and Ken. Hello. Hi. So Suga and Ken, we are going to that place where Magellan, the, the Spanish, uh, Spanish, but the Portuguese, who went here. And planted that cross, and we will also go to to uh, the church where Santo Niño, the old Santo Niño, is uh, is being shrine. So, when, you know the Santo Niño, it's like the little Jesus, yeah. And it was presented to the Queen Queen Juana, the former Queen of the Moon. So it was presented as a gift. And after 40 years, when the Spaniards came, that uh, that uh, Santo Niño was still there. Or that we will go there and look for that. We will see that now um, in that church. Are you yeah. excited? Yeah! <laughs> Let's go now! <laughs> so, that is where the Magellan's Cross is located. That's the, that's the city hall. And this is the church. Uh huh. And that's where the Magellan's Cross. They put like, what do you call that? Like, what do you call Pagod? <laughs> I mean the, the like a small shelter for the cross.
of the Spaniards came 40 years after we built this church. So we just got back from Magellan Cross and the Kansas Hill. Hopefully, in the sky, you know, it was very beautiful because it was uh, not only historical but also an enshrined uh, church, the bar. And how was it? It was so Yes. And we are going to Temple of Leia in the mountains of Cebu. So the Temple of Leia is not an old uh, destination, it's very new, okay? Yeah, the one husband, a very loving husband, uh, after his wife died, after his wife died, um, he built a temple in their property in the mountains of Cebu. So we're going there and see how beautiful it is. Okay! Wow. My first time, guys. Yay. Let's go. Hey, <laughs> Nako. <laughs> so, going there, <laughs> we can see the province of Cebu capital. It's the, where the governor of Cebu is doing business, I guess. It's the province of Cebu. Cebu City and the province is not, not the same. So, okay, because there is a province of Cebu. There. It's like the White House of the Bill, where the governor is living or is doing this. So finally we are here in Temple of Leia and how do you find it guys? Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, very beautiful and and very relaxing because the it's it's sunny but it's very cold. The, the air is very cold. But right now we'll go to another spot, famous spot here, just near. It's like 22 minutes away, it's Sirau. Uh, Garden, it's called Little Amsterdam, but it's Sirau Garden. It's just uh, near here. So let's go! Hey!
So we have arrived to Sirao. Wow. Sirao Gardens. We have arrived after 20 minutes of driving. You know, here in Sirao, guys, it's very beautiful. They have also, if in Thailand, they have the hand of Buddha. Here, we have the hand of Shiva. <laughs> Let's go to the hand of Chita. <laughs> 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 the, the finger of Chita is very big, guys. <laughs> and you'll take a photo here and overlooking the mountains of Cebu. Woohoo! See? And it's over there, there is also a party going on. I don't know what party is that. So basically, you will see here the native flowers and leaves and different ornamental garden plants here in Sirao. Very beautiful. I like it here. Okay. Breathtaking. It's really it's breathtaking and uh, the view is very lovely because it's nature. Okay. It has lots of ornamental plants. Flowers there, flowers everywhere. <laughs> So that ends our Cebu day tour for today here in Sirao. Hopefully you also come here in Sirao and enjoy as much as we have enjoyed. Ooh, look at the birds! <laughs> as much as we have enjoyed also here. And if you have some comments or questions, you can put it here in the comment box. Bye! Okay.